going on guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today we're back playing Woodmill Inc and we're actually going to be doing our base a bit and we're going to go and buy a couple conveyors to start off the video. I did do a video on the pink trees in the last episode, the new pink trees, if you haven't seen them go check them out. If you guys want to go on a hunting spree with me then I recommend that you join the discord where I will be going live in the near future going on woodmill and hunting these trees down to find it with you guys but that won't be today or either probably tomorrow but i do have work starting from today and i will be uploading a lot less i'm not going to be doing these like four uploads a day because this has been crazy right why are we in the shop again i completely forgot oh yeah conveyors <laughs> But we're going to grab ourselves normal, normal conveyors. As I was saying, I do have work, so unfortunately uploads will be slower from this video onwards. And if I have any extra news for you regarding the game updates, I'll make sure to record a video as fast as I can. But we are going to keep buying some conveyors. I think we're actually able to buy one at a time. Oh, that's depressing. Are we able to make it flat? There we go. And now let's buy another one. And there we go. This is the one we want. Chat with David. Are you sure you want to purchase this funnel conveyor for 110? Of course I would. Right, let's go. Okay, now we've got ourselves our two conveyors. We're going to literally just go to our base, put it on the sawmill, and then we're going to go get ourselves some birch wood. Because... You guys have been commenting down in the comment section down below saying these cherry trees are still really good despite the nerf and that the and that the birch trees are good as well. I did test out how long it would take to get some birch trees and it didn't take that long. You just need to be comfortable with doing the long distance and how long it's going to take but I still think that my method that I said about was good for you guys to get easy money if you wanted easy money. Does that work? Something doesn't look right here. Right, let's move it again. And if you want to get this little fat little mouse thing on the Xbox, you literally just press the button that is left under the Xbox light. And this looks very interesting. Also guys, stock up on your wood as you can now because the square wood will be more expensive as of right now the sawmills haven't been updated and these are definitely going to be updated in the near future stock up on all your wood so then you get to become rich in the near future is that upside down are these both upside down well it's gonna it's gonna stay like this i think oh wait the entire sawmill's the wrong way around what? <laughs> there we go. And now, if we flip this one. What? Wait. No, this is, uh, wait. Is this the wrong way round? Like this, and then like that. There we go. That's really confusing to put together. But <laughs> we managed to do it. So, I think we've actually did it the wrong way round, actually. I think we were supposed to put this one over there. And then that one over here. But we'll change that out in a, near, in a future video. Because now we're actually going to get ourselves some birch trees. Right, let's go to the birch trees. And we are at the top. Well, not quite at the top, but we're somewhat at the top. That person must be getting some sort of wood. Because I, I saw them going up in the last episode too. But... These trees seem to be a little bit thinner than they was before. That might just be me though. But we're going to chop them down, we're going to grab them, and we're... Oh, never mind, they actually look just as thick now that they're let down. And let's see if we could just do this, right? Like that? Is that a way to, to like, get all the, the wood at once? Does this work? People said you should drag it, so if we just pick it up, we'll test out the dragging method first and no that doesn't work so drag it like this no it doesn't work you can't I don't think you can Y 
Yeah, oh, wait, like this? Wait, we, I think we're getting somewhere here. No, this is very inefficient, like, what the hell, especially on a controller. If you're on a controller, this is very inefficient, as you can see. Even zooming in, it doesn't fix anything. I say that, and then it fixes itself. But if it's behind you, I guess it is, uh, it works. But there's no way for me to decide where it goes. As you can see, it just dropped again. And, yeah, this is just very annoying. So, overall, I can only take one birch tree. Other people are saying they can take up to, like, three birch trees. I physically do not see how that's possible. Like, I do not, I don't know how, unless you're able to put a couple birch trees on the back, piling up, then I don't think you're able to put an exactly full, like, one full birch tree is enough. One and a half full birch trees, you might be struggling. But two birch trees? Nah, I don't believe you. I don't believe that. It is that is like you can actually do that unless uh, it is to do with the bigger truck which I do not have yet but judging from right now you can only pick up one one tree at a time and this car is not going to be able to support this long type of tree just look at it it's curved and not straight it's gonna fall off it does go into the wood drop off quite nicely and we did get about five hundred dollars for it so we are going to go into the shop now that we've sold our tree, and as it's night time, unfortunately, it's just going to get harder to see. So we're going to light up our base. So buying this Alpha Axe, we're basically I said we were going to buy an Alpha Axe in almost every video. I've made a couple videos, so we're going to buy a couple Alpha Axes actually. And there we go, there's one. We'll buy three. Let's buy three of them. And then we'll have enough money left over to buy a light to light up our slot. How much is the next sawmill, by the way? This is what we need to aim for. 6,000? I did get up to 8,000, but I bought loads of alpha axes. But we can get the sawmill in a later update when the alpha axes are potentially removed. I just want to focus on getting these alpha axes and recording videos for you guys. So then we are rich in the future. Remember guys, you guys need to stock up on your Alpha Axis too, even though there's going to be a very, very small demand for these Alpha Axis in the future, as in like when the Alpha has turned into Beta, there's going to be a very, very small demand. But when the game is available for everyone at the same time, the demand is going to skyrocket. Not just straight away though, not straight away. The price is 650 Of course it's going to go up, but it's not going to skyrocket. The skyrocketing happens about a year or two later. Maybe three. Look at how long Lumber Tycoon has been around, and look at how expensive the prices for they are. And at the same time, you already still have mods and duplications to make it duplicate all the time. So technically that should make the prices go a lot cheaper than it already is, but as the duplications have been fixed, we're already seeing a lot of the average price is coming back into into tuition. Okay, and now we're going to buy this for 400. We're just going to buy one because they are big and we don't need them, but this is all we need. It's literally just one. Actually, no, we have one at our base, don't we? Sorry, Dave, I'll put it back. I'll put it back for you now, Dave. This is the best I can do, unfortunately. But I think it is a very good place that I put it. I think I did a good job. If you want to hire me at your store, just let me know, okay? I'm happy to restock your shelves for you. But we're going to actually buy a couple more Alpha Axes, as we don't need to buy that light now. And another thing we could do is we could actually either buy another conveyor, or we can buy all of the blueprints to get our blueprints stocked up. But at the moment, the reason why I haven't done that is because there is currently bugs with the blueprints, and... Is this the correct conveyor that I wanted? Normal conveyor, yes. So, at the moment there is a current bug with the blueprints where if you die, you lose your blueprints. I, I have noticed that, but I didn't notice that when I kept dying. I kept buying my blueprints and then you guys made me seem like I'm crazy, being like, Tyler, you need to buy the blueprints, you need to buy the blueprints. I'm like, I did buy the blueprints, I know that what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> but then I realised later on after the video that I didn't buy the blueprints, that I died and you'd currently lose your, your blueprints when you die, which 
is a current problem. But we have ourselves a conveyor and a couple more alpha axes. We are just going to go to our slot. And we're going to... It's so bright over there. It's so amazing. That base light right there is probably one of the best lights ever added into one of these type of games. Like, I've not ever seen a light just as good as this. And they'll probably potentially add more lights in the future. Conveyor, just go here. God, you're in the way. <laughs> we want this one. That's what I wanted to unbox. And now we want another light. I keep thinking that it's going to appear as a blueprint that to place down, but it's not. And that would be a good idea to make sure they don't fall over all the time. But we're going to put this one over here and on the corner. And we're going to turn them on. So if you don't know how to do that, there's two lights at the back of the tool draw work light and it turns on like this and now I basically have like a stage studio where I'm like yo guys you can't see what's behind me properly it's all lit up using stage lights and we're all ready for some sort of film production but it is starting to reach the end of the video I have work in a couple hours but if you did like this video make sure to leave a like and subscribe turn the notifications on so you get to see the next video uploaded from me on the channel and I shall see you guys in the next one Bye.